Acne is the commonest inflammatory dermatosis. The prevalence is increasing, and it appears to be presenting earlier and lasting longer. The burden of acne is concentrated in adolescence between 10 and 19 years, with a sharp drop-off after the age of 20.1 however, some people will have persistent disease. The visible nature of acne makes it a cosmetically unacceptable problem for many young people and having acne may result in significant impairment of psychosocial well-being and quality of life. Point two, around 20% of adolescents will have moderate to severe acne. Acne is usually triggered by the hormonal changes of puberty, resulting in increased sebum production, changes in the pilosebaceous follicles, colonization with Cutibacterium acnes, C. acnes, formerly known as Propionibacterium acnes, and inflammation resulting from both innate and adaptive immune reactions. Genetic factors may influence both acne severity and duration of the disease. What causes acne? During puberty, your skin gets oilier. This can cause pimples. There are many myths about what causes acne, but there are really only three main causes. 1. Hormones. You get more of them during puberty. 2. Heredity. Acne can run in families. 3. Plugged oil ducts. Small whiteheads or blackheads can form when the oil ducts in your skin get plugged with oil and skin cells. They can turn into the hard and bumpy pimples of acne. What doesn't tea cause acne? Don't let people tell you it's your fault. It's not. Acne is not caused by one dirt. That black stuff in a blackhead is not dirt. No matter how much you wash your face, you can still get acne. Two contact with people. You can't catch acne from or give acne to another person. Three your thoughts. Thinking about sex won't cause acne. Four food. Even though soft drinks, chocolate, and greasy foods aren't really good for you, they don't cause acne directly. There is some information suggesting a diet high in sugar and starch may worsen acne, however. What you can do. Don't pop or pinch your zits. All this does is break open the lining of the oil ducts and make them more red and swollen. This can also cause scars. Don't scrub your skin too hard, it irritates the skin. Other things that can irritate the skin are headbands, hats, chin straps, and other protective pads like football players use. Don't use greasy makeup or oily hair products. These can block oil ducts and make acne worse. Do learn how to handle stress. Sometimes stress and anxiety can cause pimples. Try to keep your stress down by getting enough sleep and having time to relax. We are coming to the end. Thank you for watching this. Enjoy other content on our channel. We've already talked about the benefits of oregano tea for digestion. We have already talked about the three worst foods in the world. We've talked about the benefits of the egg diet. We've talked about the benefits of lemon water and much more.